This next trick is called an assisted squiggly. Uh, that's kind of my own name. This is not a very easy trick if you do not do it right. To do this trick, you're going to start off with one and a half mount. This starts out almost like a 1A trick, but eventually becomes a 3A trick. What you're going to do is you're going to swing it over like the trick Buddha, Buddha's Revenge. Then you're going to pop the AO into both of those strings and over your pointer. Here. If you draw your pointer finger like that, so it looks something like this. <laughs> and this trick, it is crucial that you get an extremely straight throw. So, you see, uh, try again. What you're going to do is you're going to remove your pointer finger from this, keep your thumb in there just to keep the loop there. Then make, put your pointer finger in there, pointing towards yourself. And then you're going to put the other loop that you're holding on your other pointer, like that, on there. From here, now you can use your left hand, because it's free. Throw a breakaway. Wind it up like that, so it can be assisted, and then fit the second loop that was in your hand onto the into the gap of the AO. So let me show you. Oh, that looks, oops. Then you're going to make kind of a seasick motion. I'm not very good at this, so... From there, you just drop the yo-yo, and it should come off pretty slightly easy. Drop everything that you were holding, and that should come off. And then, you're basically in just two breakaways, and you can buy from there. That's an assisted squ 